Hey, good afternoon everybody. It's JJ, the karaoke rideshare driver, and this video is going to explain how to perform a factory reset on your Echo Auto device without having to call tech support. Uh, the first step that you're going to need to do is go into your cell phone Bluetooth settings and look at the list of paired devices, um, pick the Echo Auto, and then click to forget device. So forget device, that's step one. Um, step two, you can open the um, put mute on here. You can open the Alexa app and get that ready to add device. And from there, you're going to um, and I already pressed this button, but from there, you're going to need to press the mute button. Of course, the red light comes on, and I already did this, but you're going to press and hold the reset button with the white dot don't let up until the blue light comes back on and you get an acknowledgement that your device has been reset and you'll hear that so then you can finish the rest of the steps in the Alexa app to finalize your connection to your cell phone so I think this can be helpful if you're having a trouble a problem like I was where she migrated all, all on her own <laughs> over to Bluetooth and I want her running online in or maybe you want to pair it to another cell phone or something like that. Now I haven't tested that, but um, that might be one reason that you'd want to do a factory reset is to get it paired to someone else's, uh, to be able to be used on, I guess, on someone else's cell phone. But I'm not exactly sure how that would work because I think they still need to use the Alexa app. So they might have to be an authorized user on your account. Um, Anyways, it's just a thought, but that's how you can do a factory reset. As always, thanks for watching, everybody. Have a great day, and we'll catch you next time.